How many people are in your family? Hi, Sarah. How are you today? Hi, John. I'm good. Thank you. How about you? I'm doing well too. Thanks. By the way, I wanted to ask you how many people are there in your family? Well, let me think. In my family, there are four people. There's my mother, my father, my younger brother, and me. So we are a family of four. How about you? That's nice. In my family, we have five members. There's my father, my mother, my two sisters, and me. So we are a family of five. Oh, that's wonderful. Do you have any pets? Yes, we have a pet dog named Max. He's a friendly and playful Labrador Retriever. How about you? Do you have any pets in your family? No, we don't have any pets at the moment, but we've been thinking about getting a cat. I love cats. They are so cute and independent. Cats can indeed make great pets. They're known for their independent nature. If you decide to get a cat, make sure to take good care of it and provide it with a safe and comfortable environment. Definitely, I will keep that in mind. So, going back to the topic of family, are you close to your siblings? Yes, I am. I have a good relationship with both of my sisters. We spend a lot of time together and share our joys and sorrows. How about you and your brother? Are you close? Absolutely. My brother and I are really close. We have a lot of fun together and support each other through thick and thin. He's not just my brother, but also my best friend. That's wonderful to hear. Having a close bond with siblings is a special blessing. It's great that you both get along so well. Thank you, John. Family is indeed important to me. We may have our differences, but at the end of the day, they are the ones who truly care for us and stand by our side. You're absolutely right, Sarah. Family provides us with love, support, and a sense of belonging. They are our foundation and a source of strength. Couldn't agree more, John. Well, it was nice talking to you about our families. It's a topic that brings warmth and happiness. Let's catch up again soon. Definitely, Sarah. I enjoyed our conversation too. Take care and have a great day. You too, John. Goodbye. Goodbye, Sarah. Do you have any brothers or sisters? Hi, Emily. How's your day going? Hi, Alex. It's going well. Thank you. How about you? I'm doing great, too. Hey, I wanted to ask you, do you have any brothers or sisters? Yes. I have one older brother. His name is Michael. How about you, Alex? Do you have any siblings? No, I don't have any brothers or sisters. I'm an only child. It's just me and my parents. Oh, I see. Having siblings can be fun, but being an only child also has its advantages. You get all the attention and don't have to share things. 
That's true. Sometimes I do wonder what it would be like to have a brother or sister to share experiences with. I can understand that. Growing up with a sibling can be a special bond. You have someone to play with and share your joys and sorrows. Definitely. Do you and your brother get along well? Yes, we do. Michael and I have a good relationship. Of course, we have our occasional arguments, but we always manage to resolve them and support each other. That's nice to hear. Having a supportive sibling can be a great source of strength. Do you spend a lot of time together? Yes, we try to spend time together whenever we can. We enjoy going for walks, watching movies, and having conversations. It helps us stay connected despite our busy schedules. That sounds wonderful. I've always wondered what it would be like to have a sibling as a constant companion. Well, having a sibling can be both fun and challenging. You get to share many memorable moments and build lifelong memories. I can imagine. So, what about your parents? How do they feel about having two children? They are very happy. They love us both equally and always make sure we feel loved and supported. Our parents encourage us to pursue our dreams and guide us along the way. That's great to hear. Family support is so important in our lives. Even though I don't have siblings, my parents have always been there for me. Absolutely. Family support is invaluable. It's a blessing to have parents who care about us and help us navigate through life's challenges. I couldn't agree more, Emily. Family plays a crucial role in shaping who we are and providing a sense of belonging. Indeed, Alex. Our families are our roots, and they give us a strong foundation to grow and thrive. Well said, Emily. Thanks for sharing about your brother and family. It's been nice talking about this topic. You're welcome, Alex. I enjoyed our conversation, too. If you ever have any more questions, feel free to ask. Family is always an interesting topic. Thank you, Emily. I'll definitely keep that in mind. Have a great day. You too, Alex. Take care and talk to you soon. What does your dad do? Hi, Sarah. How are you today? Hi, Tom. I'm good, thanks. How about you? I'm great, too. By the way, do you know what my dad does for a living? No, I don't. What does your dad do? Well, he's a doctor. He works at the local hospital. That's interesting. What kind of doctor is he? He's a pediatrician. That means he specializes in treating children. Oh, that's wonderful. Your dad must be really good with kids. Yes, he is. He loves working with children and helping them feel better when they're sick. That's so nice to hear. My dad works as a teacher at a high school. He teaches English. That's cool. I guess we both have dads who work with people in different ways. Yes, you're right. It's important to have caring and dedicated people in those professions. Definitely. So what about your mom? What does she do? 
My mom is a lawyer. She works at a law firm downtown. Wow, that sounds impressive. What kind of law does she specialize in? She specializes in family law, specifically helping people with divorce and child custody cases. That must be challenging, but also rewarding to help families during difficult times. Yes, it can be tough, but my mom finds it meaningful to make a positive impact on people's lives. That's admirable. It's great to have parents who are making a difference in their respective fields. Thank you, Tom. I feel lucky to have them as role models. So what about your mom? What does she do? My mom is a computer programmer. She works for a software company. That's awesome. Computers and technology are such important parts of our lives nowadays. Yes, they are. My mom enjoys creating new software and solving problems with coding. It must be fascinating to see her work on computer programs and make things happen. Definitely. I've learned a lot about computers from her. And she's always there to help me with any tech issues. That's really handy. It's great to have someone knowledgeable to turn to when we need tech support. Absolutely. So, it seems like we both have parents who are dedicated to their professions. Yes, we're fortunate to have such hardworking and caring parents. It's nice to share and learn about each other's families. I agree, Sarah. It's always interesting to discover what others' parents do for a living. It helps us appreciate different careers. Definitely, Tom. Thanks for sharing about your dad and mom. It was a nice conversation. You're welcome, Sarah. I enjoyed our chat, too. Let's continue to learn more about each other's lives. Sounds like a plan, Tom. Have a great day. You too, Sarah. Take care.